Hey, what's up guys? I'm back. I know it's been such a long time since I've done a video, but I'm back now. So I wanted to do a video on how to do a natural makeup look using very little makeup. So let's just get started. Um, the first thing I use is the St. Ives Renewing Collagen Elastin Moisturizer. It's really good. It makes my face really dewy and soft and just very um, brightening or sometimes I use um, Cetaphil daily facial moisturizer it's really good to it leaves my face soft and just ready for the day so the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use the Too Faced hangover primer so let's go ahead and get that on my face um, so just put it all over my and then I like to use um, there's actually I have several different um, what are these things called well actually right now I'm going to use a CC cream by IT Cosmetics I really like it because the it's kind of like a I'm not really sure what CC cream does, but it, I'm sure it's similar to a uh, concealer. But basically, it's a color correcting and also uh, it's a full coverage cream. And it also has anti-aging and hydrating um, effects, properties, I mean. So I'm going to go ahead and put it on my um, face. Um, I know I should be using a beauty blender, but I need to wash them first, so right now I'm just using my fingers. Yes, my hands are clean, so don't worry. I also like to put it like around this area as well. A little bit came out on the side. I'll just probably put it right here. Next, I like to use um, a powder. It's by Maybelline to fit me. I use the 220 Natural Beige, and I'm just gonna use a uh, regular regular face brush. It's by RL Moda. I think I got it at the dollar store or something. 99 cent store. I think it was like two three bucks. It's pretty good actually. Actually, you know what? Never mind. I think I got this on one of my it um it Ipsy boxes. I used to have Ipsy and Birch Box and Boxy Charm, but I was already getting I already had too much makeup, so I just stopped my subscription. So I'm like, I don't want to have too much makeup either. I don't want to be a makeup hoarder, even though I kind of already am. But I got it kind of stop so I'm just gonna put this all over my face just very lightly and remember this is a natural makeup look I'm really not gonna use um, many makeup products just very few I like to use for a natural look I like to use powder instead of foundation because well, when you use foundation, it does make you look like you have more makeup and it can get, depending on the foundation, you can look kind of cakey, so. But with powder, I feel like it looks more natural. You can't really tell that you have it on. Well, unless if you put too much, obviously. But um, it doesn't really make you look cakey or anything like that. Mm. Okay, that should be good. Next, I'm gonna um, put a bronzer. It's Butter Bronzer by Physicians Formula, I think. Yeah, it is. I do like this one. And I'm just gonna use a... Well, this is actually a blusher brush, but I, I use it as a... to contour. I think I got this at Walmart. It came like in a set. It was like 
15 bucks with like five brushes but it was okay it wasn't the other brushes were like okay but this one actually came out pretty good I may have put too much on this cheek And I'm going to put some on my nose, just a little bit. Um, I need to find my my um, mini bronzer brush that I use for like my nose or other areas where I want it to be more, a little bit more precise. I need to find that brush. And it looks like I have too much right now, but you know, once I blend it out better, Next, um, my all-time favorite blush is actually it's like a blush color wheel by Tarte. It has several different shades. Um, I actually like to mix all of them together. I mean, just lightly. I just lightly tap on like some of them, and then just put them on my cheeks. So the reason why I really like this natural look is because, well, first of all, you know, you don't have to put a lot of makeup on, but it also makes you look more awake and just more bright. It brightens up your face and you're ready to go. You don't look all like dead or tired or like a zombie, like how I usually look like when I wake up. And so next I'm going to use, I'm just going to lightly color my eyebrows. It's, uh, it's by Maybelline. It's a uh, Total Temptation De Brow Definer. There we go. I use shade 315 Deep Brown. And it's pretty cool. I like it. I mean, it's pretty cheap. It was only like 7 bucks or something like that. Not entirely sure. I do have the... What's it called? The... Anast Anastasia Beverly Hills pomade thingy bobs. They're a little bit pricey. Um, I haven't used them because I need to clean my brow brush. <laughs> and you know what? I think... Look, I use makeup that I don't doesn't have parabens so I think that those little pomade things have parabens I'm not sure I can't remember so I'm trying to really stay away from makeup that has parabens and that's like the main one I know like other ingredients such as like talc or um, mica yeah I think mica mica powder or mica I'm not sure but for sure like talc that one's actually pretty bad too so but a lot of my makeup has it unfortunately and i'm not just gonna throw it away because you know it does cost money and i did so i did throw some of my makeup away that had parabens because parabens like i'm not a scientist or a doctor but i have heard i'm pretty sure you guys have heard too that parabens is pretty bad it, it can cause cancer um They've been making a lot of products that, you know, don't have parabens. Not just makeup, but like other beauty products and all that. Like shampoo and lotions, um, hand soap, things like that. So, and then last but not least, oh no, trying to look for my, trying to look for my, what's it called? Eyelash curler. I can't find it. Oh boy. Oh, you know what? Give me one sec. I think I know where it is. It's 
Sorry guys, it was actually in my purse. So, I know the lighting looks kind of bad right now. Um, but hopefully, you know, it actually looks, I think it looks pretty nice. It looks pretty natural. And last thing that I do is just curl my eyelashes. Sometimes I do put mascara, sometimes I don't. But, um, when I do, I do feel like it kind of, you know, starts to run, like, not, not run off. Well, I guess, yeah, run off and it starts to kind of, like, fall here. And then it kind of, you know, gets on my eyelids, too. And I don't really like that. When I wear, like, my regular full face makeup, well, you can't really tell when it does that. Because I have my eyeliner on and my eyeshadow and my um fake eyelashes i'll definitely do a video next when i do like my full face um i actually have like two other makeup looks where i just do um i do put my full face but i don't put foundation i still use eyeshadow um uh, powder um foundation powder foundation whatever it's called the fit me one and then um, I do put eyeliner and eyeshadow and mascara, but I don't put like a full, full face. When I mean by full face, like I put, you know, um, concealer, foundation, um, more contour, uh, highlight, um, what's it called? Uh, setting powder, like fake eyelashes. I go like all out. So I kind of have like a semi full face and then like an actual full face this one right here is just a natural look so right now i'm not gonna put mascara because like i said I don't, I don't like when it um starts to chip off and stains my eyelids and all that i like it just like this and you can kind of tell already it's kind of coming together so um and then i do actually put um chapstick or a little bit of um I'm using the sun bun chapstick cocoa balm pina colada it doesn't really smell or taste like pina colada oops too close and I actually like to use I guess we could probably go with this one I'll, I'll put a lipstick on like the wet and wild lipstick this is shade 913c I just put like something very light. I don't go all crazy. Or I'll put lip gloss. But yeah, basically that's it. Um, that's the natural look. It, nothing too crazy. It's just to brighten up your eyes and your face. And so you wouldn't look so tired, you know. And I also do this when I don't really have time to put a full face on. Like especially like if I'm like running late or you know. Or I woke up late, you know, and I don't have time to do a full face or if I'm like, I don't have the energy. So yeah, this is it. Hope you guys like it. Um, let me know if you guys want to see more makeup videos or other videos. Um, so please like and subscribe. Thank you and have a good day and please stay safe. Bye.